Aww, so this just happened. Look, so former G Unit rapper Lloyd Banks dropped his first proper studio album in over a decade last week. Titled The Curse of the Inevitable, or Coty for short, the project serves as the long awaited follow up to 2010's HFM2, which is Hunger for More. As loyal G Unit fans rushed to consume the 18 track project, they were likely searching for any reference to G Unit boss 50 Cent. In 50 Cent's book, Hustle Harder, Hustle Smarter, the rapper turned television executive called Banks lazy, something that evidently didn't sit right with him. Fans think that Banks addresses the friction between the ex group mates on the Coty song, Stranger Things, in which he raps, when you're f***ed up, behavior turns you regular quick. Sometimes the pressure overwhelms when you're the head of the clique, but don't get ahead of yourself. I ain't bending for shit. Nobody sees your vision until you're successful. He continues, Your favorite's nowhere near me when I'm dedicated. Always humbled, usually disciplined, and never hated. Call me quiet, call me lazy, talent never faded. It's frustrating when you're grinding and appreciated. Should have been dead in my 20s, shit, at least I made it. Guess I gotta prove myself again, increase your payment. 50 Cent may have inadvertently insulted Banks and Hustle Harder, Hustle Smarter, but he also accepted culpability for his perceived shortcomings. I always felt that if I had maybe done a better job teaching Banks and Yayo how to evolve and change their habits they each would be in better places right now he writes in the book explaining they both had unfulfilled potential while i was out hustling banks was more content staying on his porch and watching the world from there banks wanted things to come to him as opposed to going out and getting them for himself that's not me trying to assassinate his character the guy has lazy lloyd tattooed on his arm he literally wears his laziness on his sleeve the course of the inevitable arrived on june 4th with features from freddie gibbs benny the butcher and styles p among others but yeah what do you guys think Thing. Do you get a chance to check out the album? Do you think that this is Lloyd Banks' best work? Or do you think that his previous stuff is better? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Once again, I'm your boy Pro the Goat. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.